Alright, so today we'll be removing a fuel injector off a hat car PX9. So first you want to do is, uh, without adjusting anything, you could just remove this one because it's, it's blocking the, the screw on the other side. There's one screw there and there to remove the fuel injector. It's already, already came out. I already, already loosened all of them. And this one just pops out as soon as you remove that, that center bolt right there. It just pops out so you don't have to mess with no, uh, no adjustments on there. So it gives you an open uh, area to work with to remove that stud right there. Once you do so, you could remove the little wires on top. Just fold them there. After there, you have to remove the, the fuel, fuel line inner inlet, which is this one. You see it connect, it goes in there and it uh, kind of connects to the bottom of the fuel injector. So you have to remove this first in order for you to remove the fuel injector. In order to do that, you see what the camera angle, you'll see it, it's nearly right there is where the fuel line connects. This is the fuel line on the other side. I had it disconnected already. Uh, I removed this plug to, in order to remove the support plug for the fuel line. You'll see it, it's right there. It just pops out. It just pops right out. As soon as you remove, this nut, this one's a 24 millimeter. Uh, you just unscrew it. Once you unscrew it, then you could just pry it out. Once you pry it out, then you can remove the, the fuel injector. I uh, make sure there's no debris that goes in there. So it sits, it sits sort of right there. That ball. That's where it sits. You have to remove that first. In the same process of installing, make sure it just pushes in, just like so. Put the two screws. You can put, you can put the rocker in there, connect it, bolt it, torque it down. Uh, you don't have to mess with this. Make sure you do not miss. Don't move the adjuster. And then put the connectors, put everything back. After you're done, the top piece, and then you could work with uh, with the new one. Just slightly put it in, and then uh, put the nut, torque it down, and then just assemble everything. And there you have it. If you have any other questions, let me know. Uh, please subscribe. It helps out. And if you have any comments, uh, let me know.